on underhooks from the over-under position and using those underhooks to attack for the takedown. So we have our friend Angie here, represent Flow Athletics, and she's going to help me out. Very nice. Alright, so, <laughs> over-under, pretty basic position, we get into this a lot. Uh, as I've said in a couple of my other videos, this position is 50-50. My goal and my opponent's goal is to either get two underhooks, right, or just get to the one underhook. So what I really like to do is instead of fighting for these two underhooks, because Angie's smart, she's going to fight on the other side, I'm probably not going to win that battle. I want to get to a single underhook. So let's try it from this side. First move, really basic. I'm going to use my shoulder on Angie's chest. Shoulder bump, that gives me just enough space to move my head right into this pocket. This is the pocket. I want to put my head there. Shoulder bump, boom. Put my head in the pocket. My other hand, whether it's wrestling or MMA, I want to be using this hand to control on the far side, especially if it's MMA. If I let this drop, I'm going to eat some shots. So, control it over here. Now, this whole side, the underhook side, is open for attack. So my favorite attack from here is the single. I'm going to drive the underhook up, get my single leg. Let's do that a couple more times, folks. Work on a couple more details. So, number one, bump. Put my head in the pocket. The underhook itself, let's talk about that for a second. I want to be controlling Angie's shoulder and driving my elbow up. This weakens, this weakens her counter, which is the wizard. Angie starts wizarding hard, right? That hurts. My shoulder's up, try to wizard hard. Eh, a little bit tougher to do. All right, so I'm gonna keep this elbow up, control her shoulder, step behind as I punch my arm to the sky. Punch my arm to the sky. Look, I use this other hand to grab the leg, and now I bring that arm down. There's my single. Yeah.